engine temperature comparison between a uh, liquid cooled Harley and an air cooled Harley. This is a 22 um, 114, and this is a the 24 117, and they're they're similar similar miles. They both got about 4,000 miles on them, and we're gonna see what the temperature difference is. I'm gonna take a couple different measurements off the motor, and see what it is. We're gonna ride about 10 minutes and check it, and then we'll ride about 20 minutes at highway speed and check it again. And we'll see what it is. Okay, my bike, the 24, said it was 208 when I pulled in here, but I'm not sure where that temperature is coming from. But we're in the two temperatures now. Right by the serial number, and this is 130. Cheers. 170, 171, 56, head, 186 on his, cylinder, Front cylinder, 240, 240, 220, let's see, bend some more 230, five or so. All right, we got some temperatures now. We're gonna ride. What are we gonna do now? Ride five or so more miles? Yeah, we'll do like highway speed, like 65 or 70, just cruising. Think? Yeah. All right. We'll try that. All right, we'll be back. Well, yeah, this ain't an exact science. The Road King don't have any temperature sensors on it like the Street Glide does. But uh, that should be close enough for a comparison at least. You can bullcrap about it, compare them. Should be close enough. But we're gonna get riding. We're gonna do uh, about 10 minutes, 15 minutes highway speeds, 65, 75 miles an hour, and compare the temperatures again. We're gonna get riding. Check the temperature. Engine block here, one. 57. And Jared's. At 200. Check his rear cylinder here, middle. 20 mine 185 and 
valve cover. And then 62. Two oh one on his. That's a pretty big difference. Big difference? One sixty and two oh one on the forty forty cover. degrees? Yeah. I wonder what the gas tank is. Okay. One oh five right there. Hundred on mine. Hmm. That's a big difference. That's a pretty big difference. That's what I figured. Modern technology makes a difference. Yeah, so they may... When did they, when did they come out with that? I have no idea. 14, I think. Oh, they started doing it again. The more PA 14. 14, I think. And then 23 and a half, 24, they changed it to look like the cool heads. So, it seems to make a big difference. All right. We're going to check it again later, right? Yep, we're going to head back home. Uh, it's about uh, 25 minutes, maybe, from the house. When we get back, we'll check it again, see if it tracks the same, and then we'll go from there. We just got back. We're back. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do forty-five. Pretty big difference, ain't it? Yeah, 40 or 60 degrees is a big difference when you're only talking about. There's probably average degrees. 50 degrees cooler. Yeah. So. Big difference. Well, we figured it's about a between a 40 and 60 degree difference about every measurement we could take. So, I mean, I haven't really crushed the numbers, but it's about a 50 degree average difference. About. So that's a pretty pretty big difference. I, mean, I, don't, I don't know what percentage difference that is, but. 50 degrees and 200 degrees is, yeah. that's a pretty big difference. We're not talking about 200 that's degrees. 25%, yeah. So it makes a difference. I don't know what difference it makes in the grand scheme of the motor, but. I mean, 50 degrees difference if you're sitting on top of the thing would make a difference. Yeah, yeah. Like you're riding through traffic and whatever. Yeah. So, I don't know how what difference that would make. Making your oil last longer, making your motor lasts longer. Hey, I, don't, I don't know the technical specifications yeah. of what, what that what that means for the motor, but it definitely runs cooler. Yeah, for sure. I know it's it's really not the most scientific way of testing it, but it's close enough to be able to tell. I mean, it, it, every measurement was between 40 and 60 degree difference, so. Yeah. And there's yeah. really no, not much difference the way they run mine and yours, right? No. I mean, perform it twice. No, I mean, the, the 117 definitely. Runs harder. It's not like night and day difference. Yeah. But it's, it's it noticeably runs mm. harder. Okay. Well, the wa the water cooled heads for sure make a difference. Yeah. Well, anyways, thanks for watching, and hopefully we'll see you in the next one. <laughs>